Good morning everybody. It's the Tin Man. Bright and early. Nice and cheery. You know, I've been here before on Keystone. And I got something interesting to show you folks. I thought I'd do it in this format. Hopefully you like it. I'm scruffy and not even cleaned up. Just heading towards a cleanup spot. I wonder if I could use this as long as I don't fall in. But I've talked about this place before, so it's changing. A pattern that I'm noticing right now along here that is very obvious and awesome is see the darkness around the tree area? Each one of these tree areas, they haven't started worrying about my finger is not right on so but cleaning it up so much see that gives a whole vein right here a whole vein of dirtiness coming down because it's nice and covered by the trees now we come over close and you see the fragments of all this cleaning you see nothing for fragments part of the reason is don't want to have to deal with the tree it's hidden, so to us it's hidden, I guess. And I think in a lot of ways they try to hit important areas of a lot of crumble and then go with the heavier stuff wherever it defrags to, right? But, um, you know, that part is whatever. But you can see, once again, this is pr pretty foliaged here. But then we're also getting into these spots too where in these spots here they come in and they just... We're parked over there. They're just starting to work on that wall well. And it shows such a statement of fresh, clean wall. Right here. So right here, they haven't done much. You see the color variation and everything, right guys? You see now the color, you just rewind, and you see how the color on that other part is um, significantly less than this aged baked color. Fair enough. And that, I just hear something keep yelling out there in the background, so if you guys can hear it. Um, I'm not talking about the twerking bee birds, but... Um, in a lot of these cases, I've talked about it before, where it's quite easy to be able to tell. See, me doing this won't kill it, because it's just going to reattach and start to regain itself. Whoops. Down wherever it lands. But I'm just trying to show you what, like, when they come in here and they strip it off, that you'll see patterns like this going on in kind of heavy spottings. Because they'll, they'll take that stuff away and put it wherever else they want it. Because their job is about cleaning up this rock. So Keystone, and we'll remember that rock there is pretty cleaned up. I've already done some of this block before. And it's growing since then. Like that wall's growing, the amount of cleanup and stuff. One more thing before you take off. I just wanted to show that great big boulder right there. Hopefully you're seeing it well. But on this edge, it's got scuffed marks. Chip scuffed marks. Note that rock's always been sitting there. You can see how deep it goes in under. Well, that's just somebody mucking on it or something. I was wondering if that rock had maybe been move. It's open the gym then. <laughs> 